time for another update. Haven't had one in about a month or two. So it's been quite a while. Nothing really. I haven't got anything new. I'm saving up for a uh, new camera. But uh, I've done a couple of weathering jobs. First, we'll start out over here with... This here. This is a uh, was a bulkhead flat car that had all the uh, the things going up there. I broke those off and uh, took an old other blue box. Used the sides, made some little supports, and right. there you go. Bit better. Has some supports and just stuck that on there, weathered it up. Over on the side I took a lighter. <clears throat> Let's bump that pretty nice. And then my other weathering job over here. is my Norfolk and Western auto rack car there we go my eye weathered this the uh, picture I I think this is one of my best uh, better jobs Rush streaks to weather the bottom of it. And I did the trucks. Now it's kind of hard to see. Well, got that. The two weathering jobs I've done. And then over here, okay, uh, over here, I have trimmed down this foam here, which used to make the big the track go up quite a bit. But uh, now I trimmed that down. I had to throw a few track spikes in. So you can probably see the heads of them there. Threw those in and it smoothed it out quite a bit because they would always derail. Over here at this crossover because of the difference in height of the track. So, with that fixed. But now, fix one thing, there's another thing to fix. Over here, these two sections of the track right here, uh, my uh, trains, they stop. The locomotive. I don't know what it is. I'm thinking bad electrical or something, but I mean, I'll have feeders over here, so I'm not really worried too much. But once I have everything, once I have all the track, all the cork and everything, throw in some, a bunch of feeders and uh, should have nice electrical contact all the way around the layout. Also, through a couple tracks. Still, and you get get a new decoder for my CSX SW1500 decoder. Blew out, so I've yet to get a new one. And then way over here, I have a, a new weathering station. The old one up in my room. Well, weathering powders and carpet—they don't mix all that well. So, carpet kind of got ruined a bit. But I did have a steam cleaner, so I was able to clean that up. But moved it down here to the basement. A lot more room. Got all my stuff everywhere. Oh. That's about it. Layout update here. So, see you guys until the next one.